on here, hang on. People yo, me. yo, yo, sorry, fucking. I'm pretty sure I'm getting DDoS, by the way. <laughs> wow, what a shock, huh? I, 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 can, I can sympathize with that. I, I know what that's like. <laughs> I, I, I'm pretty sure I'm getting DDoS. It's like, you, like, hang on, I think we're back on. Yeah, we're back on. Yeah, so, you, like, you know, your internet is getting DDoS when it turns off for just 10 seconds and then turns back on and it just. I, I, I don't know the I don't know the technical shit behind it. I'm not a computer guy. You, you pack it flooded or whatever the fuck they do to you. Um, I just mm. I, you know I'm lucky that I live in an area that's got like fucking ten different service providers. Yeah. Um. So I I've got multiple ones now. So I'm I'm fucking sitting pretty. But no, I I know the feeling. Uh, I got mm. nailed and couldn't stream for like a half an hour, forty minutes. I was yeah. like, okay, I've got to, I've got to, uh, <laughs> I've got to fix that somehow. Yeah, yeah, I think I'm gonna do that too. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get this, <laughs> uh, this one reset, and then I'm going to get a, a couple more backups just in case, because, like, it's so fucking hilarious that I showed up, I did absolutely everything, I was as honest as possible, and still. They're going after me like it's my fault. I'm not the one who fucking challenged this motherfucker. Like, what the fuck? I didn't, I, I was trying my fucking best to like, you know, just go, okay, sure, sure. Because how this started after the whole game. Uh, we're offline again. You want me to fucking stream it for you, Andy? Uh, you know what? That might actually not, not be a bad idea. And yeah, you know what? That's not a bad idea. All right, here. Just don't say that is coming from me. All right, just uh, I won't. I, that way. I won't. No, uh, you, you're you're online. It says you're live right now, Andy. Is it? Uh, it's on yeah, and off. It's back online. Okay. Oh, damn it. All right. All right. All right it's well, on. If anything happens, then right. we'll do. Uh, we'll, do, do you we'll want do... me to do a simulcast? Put it on my fucking channel. I'll turn off the fucking super chats and shit so people. No, no. For now, for uh, but for now, just leave it the way it is. Uh, right. If it fucks up, I I can get. I uh, like I have some some ways to back this up with other OBSs right. from other areas. Uh, yeah. Poor, poor little Andy out there in the world with his naked IP just waiting to get fucked in the ass. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm going to be switching my IP completely different, like, ASAP. Yeah. Um, uh, but, yeah, so what I want to uh, say, uh, uh, say like, the, the, uh, the intro, the entrance, that was the Indian headdress, the wheelchair, coming out in the Sweetie Squad sweater, Having uh fucking Ralph dressed up as Caesar, uh with Dick Masterson pushing me to the Kumite intro music, that is li that was literally, that's how you fucking beat up a cripple right there. <laughs> no, I, I I liked it. Yeah, I liked your entrance. Um, I liked that you showed up. Yeah, I mean Tonka, like I said, ran his mouth, challenged fucking everybody to fights, did the uh, internet tough guy shit for years and years and years. And you put him into a position where he couldn't get out of it. He was fucked. I mean, he was stuck in that position, and it boiled down to the last, you know, couple of days. And he looks like a fucking bitch to everybody now. Yeah. Uber drivers are talking about him. That <laughs> yeah. guy took it out. You know, so it's really weird. I'll 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 say this. Like, you know, first few weeks I was nervous, right? Um, and then I got more confident in my, you know, my skill because I was training and having a lot of fun. And then it really hit me at the weigh-in where all the fighters after we were alive or whatever, after we were done uh, streaming, all the fighters were coming up to me and they're like, yo, man, that sucks. You're, a, a dude didn't show up. I'm sorry about that. Like they're all coming. And then it, like this sadness hit me of like, fuck, like I want to be like, I want to fight. I want to be part of this. And you have these people who are facing off versus each other talking and having like having like a drink at this place like like oh man we're gonna fight soon this is crazy like you know having a good time there's you know shaking hands and shit meanwhile we have fucking bitch made tonka who's just his his goal is just to destroy like, like if he beat me it would ruin my entire career and ruin me as a human being but he doesn't get that it's about manning up and just fucking fighting. That's all it fucking is. It's nothing more than that's what MMA is, you know? I'm sure y'all beef and fight, but these people were shaking hands after the fight, you know? Well, you know, I, 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 oh, let me start off with this. Have you seen the new Dongalore that uh, Cog had pop up on his stream? No, no, what's that? Um, I have a short clip. It's like a minute at most. Sure. Uh, somebody who was a former classmate of his 
uh, wrote, uh, I guess, emailed or sent through Discord uh, information about uh, about our little Native American and oh. what he was like. It's a, it's a video clip of Cog reading out the information if you want to sure, take yeah. a listen to it and share it with. Uh, there's a nice little nickname apparently he had in school that I was unfamiliar <laughs> with <laughs> oh, <laughs> that no. you, might, you might enjoy. Okay, you'll put it in the chat here. I'll, I'll, I'll pop that up. Oh, boy. Oh boy, okay. oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Let me put this in. It's just, uh, it's on my Twitter timeline, so it's not like. Oh, uh, okay, here. I'll just, ref here, let me just go. Oh, there you go. I, I threw it in the side chat. All right, all right, work it. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Okay, so uh, you you guys won't be able to hear it, so I'll tell you, you dudes, when I'm going to hit play. So, right. here we go. All right. Okay, and. I'm going to play it in three, two, one. Back in high school, Robbie was what you would know today as the nice guy type. He had really, really long hair, always greasy. He wore a lot of WWF slash E t-shirts, and that I would have to say was his biggest hobby. He obviously got picked on a lot and ended up joining the wrestling team and actually did okay. I was friends with him. I guess he was part of all the rest of the loser crew. Uh, here comes the cringy part, okay. He would run up and wrap his arms around me and pull me into a slight headlock and <laughs> ask how I was doing. He'd ask me to come over to his house, which I'd refuse, even when I had a boyfriend senior year. He threatened to fight my boyfriend and tell me how much better he would be. This is a pretty exact quote. I'll make you love me when I become a pro wrestler. <laughs> So the biggest cringy moment Rob ever had in his high school, he sent a picture to one uh, of our mutual friends. His room in the background looked like the stereotypical nasty, dirty neckbeard room, soda bottles and trash everywhere, <laughs> dirty carpet, absolutely disgusting. He earned the nickname Slobby Robbie, a shooting nickname. I'd really love to bring that nickname back. Holy oh. shit. Oh, oh, Slobby Robbie? Dirty mm. boy, dirty oh. slobby Robbie, yeah. Oh, Robbie no. and Venti. <laughs> slobby Robbie's a terrible nickname. <laughs> Holy shit! Is I just I like how he run, I, I like how you know this image of him running up when he still had functional legs, running up to girls in the hallway and putting them in headlocks, and then saying, "You're gonna fucking love me when I'm famous." Oh. <laughs> I just picture the special ed kid running up to everyone and giving him a hug and not knowing his face. <laughs> yeah, he's in everyone's bubble. <laughs> You're like, yo, Slobby Robbie, man. You have to chill. Yeah. Like <laughs> Holy fuck! He, uh, what did you think about him? Uh, both of you, what did you, um, all three of you, what did you all think about him deleting his uh, his videos? I saw it coming. I, I don't know. I think this might like. There's some weird shit going on. Shit Rat and Holiday have privated stuff and started deleting shit. Kraut is kind of gone to ground. And, uh, you know, Tonka's privated and deleted a lot of shit, it looks like. No, Crowd is yeah, talking to Tonka really right now. No, no, like, yeah, but I'm talking on social media. He can still oh. get on to the Lancaster yeah. account, but he, he's not doing it. Mm -hmm. um, and so, I, I, I don't know. You know, I know that uh, Zoom is doing a stream tonight, and he's promising some big shit. I, I'm wondering if the rumors I've been hearing people talk about on streams and social media about him actually really getting sued is coming to fruition, and that's why he's deleting shit. Oh, uh, don't worry. I have I have like the last twelve, so if they need them. Of what? The last twelve? What? Uh, Kumites. Oh, oh, yeah. Well, I th that's what I predicted while we were driving back to uh, Nashville because I'm a fucking idiot. Uh, was I was like, yo, maybe he's trying to delete all the evidence of him going. Yeah, I'm gonna fight. Yeah, I'm gonna fight. Yeah, I'm gonna fight, which contradicts him signing a fake name. You know what I mean? Like, that's what I think. That's where I think this, why he deleted all that shit. I, I don't know. And so, I mean, I, I, I'll obviously tune in when Zoom does his thing to see, I, I guess, what um, is going to get dropped. But um, Well, Zoom wants to go after him because uh, he collected a lot of money for training uh, for the fight and for food for the did? fight. Yeah. When? Uh, where? How? There was, I don't know. I wasn't listening to the Kumite much like other people weren't. <laughs> When, when uh, a guy who's a promoter has done this for years and years and years and says, I've never seen anything like this before, you've really accomplished something. 
Well, I know Larosa's not happy. Oh no! Yeah. Like she, she she's, she, yeah, she's fucking embarrassed. Like she was almost begging Bake Alaska uh, to fight you as like a way to make amends, I guess, to Tim Loy and others uh, for the shit show that Tonka caused by not fucking showing up and doing all this underhanded shit with his uh, blood work and name and mm -hmm. stuff. See, I'd, sure. I'd I'd fight Baked and look. If I lose or he loses, I'll still shake his hand and have a beer regardless. Let's have some fun. Like that, That's the whole point of an MMA match is entertainment. There was one guy there. Uh, he was, I think, a few before me. He, he had the green mohawk. He was 11. I'm sorry, 0 and 11. And then he was 0 and 12 at the end. And we had a talk after. He's like, dude, I don't fucking care. It's like, I have fun. They pay me. I don't give a fuck. He's like, and I'm hanging out with these guys. I'm... He's like, I'm not the best fighter, obviously, but what, you know, whatever. And then he start, he's on camera with drummer eight two eight calling fucking Tonka a bitch. And this is a guy who's like zero and twelve. I wish you'd got the black dude with the fucked up eye who knocked that, <laughs> oh, yeah. who knocked that fucking Jamaican on his ass in like three seconds. That was funny as shit. Yeah. Who was the? Uh, did you get to meet the? Um, it was the uh, the kickboxing guys that went up. Uh, Mavir or whatever his name yeah, was. Yeah, yeah. I said what's up to that, the guy. Yeah, that, that was dude is like a fucking tank. Like he. I watched that whole match, and he just he never showed any signs of being hurt, and he, he was really good. I mean, he was vicious in his fucking punches and kicks and shit. Yeah. But at the very last round, they panned out with the camera, and you, I, I had no idea this happened to him because he didn't look like he was walking weird or anything, but his whole left thigh was just pure purple and black from the kicks he took, but he walked through it like a fucking tank, like it didn't affect him. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the, that match oh, was the most exciting. Yeah, there we go. That match was the most exciting, and I was fucking. We were like me and Ralph, like any big hit, we we're like standing up for like, oh, sh like it's so. It was so fun to fucking watch, <laughs> man. That was a, a blast. Andy, well, what up, Andy? Uh oh, what up? read my screen. Uh, uh oh, uh, this just came in. <laughs> okay, so we got. I mean, Ralph is probably a hippo in disguise. Seven, and then goddamn it, Kraut. So this is Kraut saying this. Uh, uh -huh. I need to lie down. I fell down some stairs, hit my head about 20 minutes ago, and I'm really dizzy. <laughs> Might talk to you guys later. What the fuck? <laughs> so Kraut just fell? What the fuck? Yeah, that's a 4, 11 p.m. So about like about 40. So uh, oh, send, send your thoughts and prayers, guys. Everyone, thoughts your and thoughts and prayers to Kraut. Uh, he was, Kraut was the entire, I love that audio clip of being like, this is how, so I think it was, Ralph was like, yo, they were saying, like, Kraut was saying that uh, you losing is going to be, like, the final nail in the coffin for your sh show and kill stream. So we hear the audio, and it's Kraut being like, the final nail in the coffin will be when Tonka walks out there, and they can see he walks. I'm like, that is, it's not even about beating me. It's about proving he can walk at this point. <laughs> That's like the yeah. win. The like win. You is... said you would have had a better match against someone in an actual wheelchair. Yo, I swear to God. And you know what's funny? I was telling the uh, uh, the fighters this and the people in the back. Uh, I was telling them, I'm like, it's funny because when people thought he was in a wheelchair, people who didn't know like the lore. They were like, you're going to fight someone in a wheelchair? And everyone's all upset. But Tonka is such a fucking dick that by this time, everyone's like, yeah, you're going to fight someone in a fucking wheelchair. He removed the stigma for fighting people in wheelchairs. That's how so shitty Tonka is. Like, <laughs> you know, I am up, size him up and go, I, I think I can take him. Yeah, exactly. Oh, he actually made it worse for people in wheelchairs. Now we're going to see people in wheelchairs are going to be like, Dude, that motherfucker's probably a shit talker. <laughs> I loved how we were uh, at eating breakfast with Nick, by the way. Within a minute, we're in the car about to leave, and then there's the picture of the actual place we were just at with an Indian outside in a wheelchair <laughs> just looking out at us. <laughs> I'm like, yo, these guys are quick. The memes did not stop. Me and Ralph and Dick and Coach and uh, Gator, we were like gut-busting laughing every like like my i have like now I, I had a more of an ab workout just on the trip laughing than on my actual training that's how much we just fucking laughed and now this whole thing with the refunds and the possible uh, a possibility of him him being sued the fake fake blood work or thick name on the blood work the fake name the changing names, but then he put a fake notary. Like the amount of fraud that's been. Right. You know what really bothered me with the fucking uh, the blood work and the name and everything? What's that? 
he had told me his name was fucking Hector, and while you know, his, everybody was putting his real name out there. Yeah. So th that really fucking bothered me, man. Yeah. So he was telling you his name was Hector. It was obviously Michael or Robert, whatever the fuck. Robbie. Yeah. And but but didn't and then okay. Here's what bothered me, by the way, was when I only knew your first name. He's mm -hmm. like, and then he's messaging you uh, or other people. And he's the only one who knows his full name. So when it's yeah. leaked, I will all know that it's 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 Andy leaking it. And I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah, yeah. By the way, uh, <laughs> Jim, have you heard about Nectar? Have I heard about what? Nectar. <laughs> oh, yeah, are Nectar we talking is... about like Godwinson here? What What do you mean uh, by Nectar? <laughs> no, oh, uh, well. <laughs> I, I saved Tonka's life one time because he had a uh, <laughs> a twin that he absorbed in the womb, and it was choking him out because it started growing on his neck again. What? Oh yeah, yeah, that was a stream uh, where the uh, ex, uh, well, associate or whatever of Tonka's came on for a while, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, that one. <laughs> so was he telling a different story? Like I know that Tonka got his ass kicked by his tag team partner after he fucked his girlfriend and then bought him a beer. But that dude brought up a story, or that st a story was brought up during that stream where apparently Tonka brought a chick to a, a match he was in, and while he was in the match, she was fucking around with some dude in the audience. So he got cucked twice? Yeah, I, I, I don't know about that. But, uh, <laughs> at this point, at this point I, like, there's so many well, was people she, was, she, was she sucking his dick in the audience? Like, what <laughs> the fuck was the story on that? How does that keep happening to one guy? How does he keep losing to all these other men repeatedly? Hmm. That was oh, the... wait, you you heard what his other nickname is? Oh, Slobby Robbie Idle now. Threats. What? Slobby Idle Robbie. Idle threats. Oh my god, that is fucking golden. Like I, I honestly like it went from like uh, you know like the fans who were coming still were a bit disappointed to like everyone at the bar like this was better than an actual fight. <laughs> like it, it, he bonded. He bonded. Like this situation actually bonded. <laughs> Wait, I'm the sorry. Community. Somebody in your somebody in your chat like is actually it's a three count if you count Joakim as well. So I mean, oh, oh, the Tonka tribe is not doing too well. No, yeah. no. <laughs> the white man stealing his women. Oh, I I told someone on the plane on the way back, right? So me and this person beside me, we were just talking, and she's like, so I so she asked what I was there for, and I told her, and she searched it, and she's like, oh, that's so cool, and then she's like, why are you wearing a or an Indian headdress. I'm like, well, have you ever heard of the Trail of Tears? She's like, oh boy. And I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, he lives in a trailer apparently, so we made it Trailer of Tears. And she's just dot. People were laughing who had no idea with this situation. No one cared, and it was funny how they were like, okay, no racism, right? Like in the back, they're like, you know, racism. So I'm like, yeah, of course. We'll come out in an Indian headdress. <laughs> and the fucking announcer, like, here's Andy Worski. <laughs> He's just chuckling. <laughs> Apparently, you could hear them talk when the ho uh, the mic was hot when I was coming, or before it came out. And they were bashing Tonka. Was that true? Uh, yeah, no, there, there was a hot mic during the intermission. Um, mm -hmm. like the chick, yeah, yeah, I haven't recorded it. The chick came on and, um, she was talking to the guy, the, in the cage or whatever. She's like, yeah. Um, she's like, I talked to him and stuff. They know not to say anything outrageous or racist or anything like that to keep it family friendly. That's, that's all she was saying. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. And then she said, uh, on her stream, the one where she's talking about like the $5,000 rape bounty. I don't know if you saw that. Uh, where someone called her or, or messaged her, you're going to get raped uh, and there's a bounty for $5,000 if you say that Andy won and Tonka lost. And then she goes, yo, fuck it. Bring all the people you, you can if you want to do that and bring a gallon of chloroform. I'm like, oof, my girl. And she goes, yeah, I checked, checked out his Twitter. It seemed a little bit racist and that was just because the pinned tweet of the Charlottesville fucking me <laughs> me and dick and everyone inside uh but then she's like but i met him he was awesome he was really cool and didn't seem racist uh so I now that I, that I have both of you in here uh failure and andy i wanted to ask a question about your little disagreement sure mm -hmm. um okay because i remember the sequence of events kind of mm -hmm. um i remember a failure you were with tonka saw on akumite or some stream that he was doing uh, and Tonka kept saying, Andy didn't pay failure. Andy didn't give him the money. 
I wasn't Angie. on that stream actually. I was I was at fucking home. I was training. I, I I'm like fucking Tonka. I was not fucking interacting with him at that time. I, I could have sworn you were, but I, Tonka kept running and saying, and "Andy never paid him. Andy never gave him the money." Uh, and then Andy said, uh, essentially, "Well, if I didn't give you, you know, if I didn't give the money, then I guess I can't charge him back." And took the money back. Right. So. Oh no 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 yes yeah that's what happened. He goes he goes I'm like. You have five minutes to say that I paid failure or else I will refund the money, right? You remember that, yeah, right? Yeah, I actually yeah. gave him the midnight. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah that, the midnight, yeah. Cool. Yeah, because Taka kept saying Andy never paid him. And then, Andy, you were basically like, well, if I didn't pay him, I guess I can't fucking refund it, or refund it can I? Yeah, and I tweeted at Andy. Yeah, Andy, Andy did in fact pay me. Uh, Tonk is wrong. You paid so, me though. Tonka... Or, or, or you tweeted me at like eleven fifty eight, and I'm like, but it's well, I Tonka. didn't. I didn't see that shit until. Yeah, fucking I know. Death, I, know I know. I know. So he let yeah. you. Like he he fucking let. I was pissed off about the pedophile shit, the mm -hmm. the the constant attacks on me, the this that, and then uh like and maybe make it clear to people. That I did pay you more than how much we made that month. Is that correct? Yeah, we, we uh, made usually somewhere between, what, uh, 100, 200 bucks a day. And we were on air for like two weeks. And some days, remember that one day uh, we made six dollars each. King. Remember that one yeah, day the, we made six dollars each. Oh, that was fucking terrible. That was, here's the thing. Let's say we were fucking. It like, was less than a hundred bucks in. a day. So, you know, some days we made it, it, forty or fifty yeah. bucks, split between three people. By the it, way, so. if we weren't raking in, if we at least had a fucking fantastic show where we had fun, but those fucking some of those shows were miserable. Some of them were fun, but then as soon as we would be like, "Oh, that was a fun show," he'd be like, um, "That was fucking gay," and would leave. No, would, yeah, would no, fucking... he actually left. Oh, can I can I ask you failure then? Okay, because it, 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 if that's the way the situation went, and you weren't you know agreeing with Tonka, but Tonka was saying that. Why did yeah. you stay stand by this faggot for so long? If he's costing you fucking money and dragging yeah, your name, I was into pissed shit. off at Andy. I was pissed off at Andy uh, for doing that and shit, and so I went yeah, but on there. Tonk, Tonk yeah. is the one that set that up, though, isn't he? I mean, he's the one that ran his I fucking know. mouth and say it, that Andy never paid you. I know I should have been mad at Tonka, especially since he claims he makes six figures. He should have fucking covered the fucking money I lost. He and claimed that asking. multiple times. Yeah, he said he made yeah. six figures on the show. How much did he but, pay you? How much did he pay me from that? He didn't pay me anything. He owes me money from the super chats that came in that day because he said all the super no, chats. No, not that, that day. Was... I mean, just in the entirety oh. of the Kumite. If he's made over a hundred thousand uh, dollars, what did you here. get? Failure, uh, failure, 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 failure. I, I heard you d deny one thing, but you told me and Geek Thulu at one point mm -hmm. that he owed you ten k. You did tell. I us really that. don't remember that, but he probably does. Here, uh, don't show it on screen because this I won't is for show Zoom it on later. Yeah, yeah, no worries. Uh, Zoom, watch fucking Zoom's channel later because uh, he's fucking digging through a lot of shit. Uh, well, yeah, sure. then I, I don't want to steal it from Zoom because I know he's got a stream and I know he wants to reveal a bunch of shit. So if it's gonna cut, you know, like cut in on the, his stuff, he's gonna talk about. I'll drop. Uh, it. Yeah, just just judge on your own. You could look at the screen real quick. This is the total from 2018. Oh, you you oh, do the maths. Oh, 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 and by the way, I just got confirmation from Zoom uh, mm -hmm. that he found a lot more stuff on an yeah. uh, old Tonka boy just recently. <laughs> he, he goes, Tonka is so fucked. Okay, so we, okay, we, we are seeing here payments found for, may I say the name? 2018. Uh, yeah, from Vamp Candy. Okay, or for Vamp Candy. Oh, from, from, yeah. sorry, sorry, from. Well, yeah. no, I, I did pay her sometimes because sometimes she would come Wait, on my Wait, is screen. this it? Yeah, that's it. That's the total for 2018. That's what all the he, fuck? That's, that's, that's all he paid you. Dude. Mm -hmm. Dude. Don't say it. I'll, I'll I, 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 I'm not going to say it, but, but dude, he gave you probably 5% of what he made. Five. I'm not even, even kidding. Even even Zidane gets more and he doesn't get paid. <laughs> Yo, that Ugh. wait. Did uh -huh. did he pay you at one point ten dollars? Uh I think uh, that was like a test, like a a test uh wait, so donation uh, or October, whatever. October, March. Dude, he he gave he gave you probably I'm, yeah, I'm not gonna say I'm not saying number I'm not saying totals. I'm not saying totals. I'm saying he gave you look from the January, for example. Look, I we were doing very similar numbers. Um, Motherfucker, somebody said five percent and he overpaid. <laughs> God damn it. 
Yeah, yo, yo, but but on January, that 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 was the month after I promoted you all of December and my show was doing fucking retarded after the uh the crowd stuff. He mm-hmm. must have made, I'm going to say, I won't say how much he paid you there. I know how much he made. He because pro- Vamp spilled it to me because she How much? How much? Vamp- to 70 me. grand. That's what she told me. 70 grand in 2018 he made and uh he ain't paying Vamp because she only gets from the fucking Streamlabs. That's why she called me for two hours and complained. And then I gave her advice, like, you need to go and do your own Twitch or own your own channel because when he leaves, he's going to leave you high and dry. I'd and you know, what, you, you, know what, you know what she did? You know what she did? What? 15 minutes later, I got an alert from fucking Google saying you are no longer the owner of fucking uh, uh, Grapple Vision. Wow, dude. So I she would went to sue. him. And, Does, is there audio of, you, of him saying... That he pays you. He oh, said, he's all. Oh, he's always said most of the money goes to failure. So, so that's all sue the motherfucker. No, no, no. Yeah, I no, I do remember that. I don't have the Kumite saved because who would ever do that? But, yeah, seriously. Um, I, I do remember him saying, "Oh, I make six figures, and uh, oh, I, I, I run. I have, I have multiple successful businesses. I, I'm not internet people. Failure gets all the money. I give the, all the failure. Tell them, tell them, failure. All the money goes to failure." And a lot of people ask and me you were why mad at fucking... me and you were mad at me when I over I overpaid you man definitely yeah. and by the way we'll discuss it like on I, uh, I'm uh, yeah, yeah. on I'm a, I'm on, a lady, on, on a future on a future paycheck I will give you the money that Holy shit I took no back Andy, for sure. it, yes failure you are a fucking idiot if that's yeah. real <laughs> if that's the amount he paid you and you stuck yeah. by this I, piece of shit you're an idiot I paid, a, like in the moron. beginning a big a big part of it like was in the beginning it was he he kept saying the whole thing of oh well you know the, the Google system and everything it's it, it's like you know fucking two three months whatever blah blah Nobody blah said it takes the, thirty days. Yeah. Uh, and he, he also was getting sued at the time. So, you know, it, it was a thing where, wait, I, what is I, he getting wait, sued what? for? Wait, hey, hey, back that up champ. What is he getting oh, sued for? Oh, he got sued by Joya, uh, for, uh, here, I'll put it in the, in the wait a minute, though. Joya, the ex-girlfriend you brought on to prove what a badass he was, was suing yeah. his ass at the time? Well, he, he told me not to uh, not to talk to her, by the way. Is that why she why. came on? Did he settle with her? Is that how he got her on the fucking stream? I bet look, look, at the, oh, look at the side chat, Jim. Oh, shit. Oh, boy. Oh, that is just oh, precious. Oh, no. Tonka. Yo, this gets... But this lore is amazing. So the people <laughs> saying that I was in it for the fucking money? What fucking money? <laughs> Yo, you I, were getting I, I just fun- wanted to fucking have a fun show, man. Like I would probably have been fucking better off going with you, Andy. Andy, you had fucking so you many fucking better off going with anybody or going Alone. on your own. Alone. I saw you doing your own streams. You did fairly okay. Well, that's how that's how I did fucking fine. Like as far as you know, getting my fucking bills paid and shit is because I did the fucking oh, failure I- in the morning thing and all that. But the fucking dude claiming that he had fucking Mercedes and Benzes was fucking jipping me. Yeah, and I was I was uh see when. When you went alone, even though we had our beef like the first time when you were back and you you spilled everything and you like you know apologized to me and stuff, and I was the one who donated to you. I was blocked on your channel, so I have to use a different account that said Andy Worski as well, but it's different. But oh, okay, oh, wait, wait, wait. was Joy the one that fucked his friend? Yes. So the chick that fucked his friend sued his ass. <laughs> 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 he got sued by the girl that fucked another dude. That's precious. But but it was funny because c- there was no dead air when you were alone. Remember, yeah. m- m- me and failure used to oh, like. He sucked the energy out of me. The problem was I was doing fucking failure in the morning. I was fucking fine. But the longer I did the show with him, and the more fucking boring the guy that fucking drained energy from me. Listen to me right now. I'm fucking passionate. I fucking actually cared about this shit at one point. And then it became a thing where I, like being told to shut up about oh fucking movies are dumb and this fucking topic is dumb and this person we can't have on because I have fucking beef. That got fucking exhausting. That's fucking gay. I had fucking fun doing streams with you, Andy. I think. I'm by the way, you know, I, I think there was one time, even Medicare, you were you made a video about something, and me and I think I brought it up, and then a, 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 a Tonk is like, no one cares, Andy, and I'm like, dude, you better talked about this. Everyone in the chat is going, let's hear your opinion on it. And he goes, no one cares. No, no, no one oh. cares. No one. And then I'm just like. And it was on my channel at that point, remember? And he was like, Andy and Failure own the Kumite now. I'm like, then why the fuck is he stopping me from this and that? And then to a point where he's like, no phone calls, Andy, no phone calls. That's why I was like, fuck 
Kumite. That was fucking lame. The, like, look at what Ralph was doing. Like, fucking phone calls was where it was at. Talk to the fucking people, but he was afraid of the fucking animes fucking calling in or Zoom calling in. Or fu- By the way, go- Ben from Golf City says, so that's why failure fell asleep all the time. Fuck yeah. <laughs> if I had to fucking well, listen I, to I, another- I'm going to say this out in the open because I, I don't know. I mean, it's it's been a weird situation. I don't know why you would have stuck with Tonkasaw for so long. Maybe it's a gay op. Maybe you're on the level. He's a likable guy sometimes. That's why. I, I'll say this. If you really want to prove yourself to the people, you should do a stream on your own if you want to make a little bit of cash doing it and dump everything, every DM message, every Discord message from the last fucking year and let the people see what Tonka saw is like behind the scenes. Yep, I think so too. And 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 failure, now that you're you're free from his grasp, that morning, like, like mm-hmm. uh, um, on Jim, uh, you also... T- talked about it on your video that morning me you geek and tonka and i was like i don't know about jf i feel like what did tonka say yeah he said if that's what you want to do fucking do it but 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 then then, how did he follow it up though he's like if i were you i would tell him to fucking suck my dick like he went on for Mm. what like five minutes and he and then i was like like he pumped me up to do it and then what was it i get a dm andy i'm gonna be on ralph's later uh don't don't worry it's just for show it's just for show and then oh, i hear Ralph last night uh opened up and said that uh fucking tonka messaged him and was like don't miss out on fucking andy show tonight something's gonna fucking happen blah, yeah blah. exactly yeah, yeah he he By set way, me up uh, can, can you clear up one thing I was always telling you, go fucking do a, a, like a side project if you're not happy on, on the fucking channel. Like, you know, do like a purple dragon thing or do some you streams did, yeah, on the did, side, but keep did. doing the fucking JF thing. I was never the fucking biggest fan of fucking JF, but I wasn't saying fucking dish it, dude. One hundred you came, I'm telling 100%. you, failure. Look at, look at the chat. People are clamoring for it. If, if you really, if that's all that dude paid you, all right. you'll make 10 yeah. times that amount doing it. He paid you a pit, a I'll, pitten I'll promote for your it. loyalty. The cogs it. probably made more money from me fucking talking these days than me. I'm trying to avoid the fucking looking like I'm looking for a cash it's, grab. It's dude. in for a penny, in for a pound. If you're gonna, if you whore it out, buddy, he treated you like a bitch for a year. If that's what we're going with, I'd fucking dump everything. He he has enough money saved that he will be able to at least pay back what he's gonna be sued for. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but but think about this: when I when I saw, even though we were pissed at each other, when I saw you back. I'm the one who promoted your stream right after yeah. my stream to make you have, and you made, and I'm like, look, look, no dead air. He's passionate. He seems happy. He seems free. He and he's making money, and it's not a cash grab. You're talking about mm-hmm. something that people are interested in because he jerked. Every, even Malcolm from the north, who hates my guts, just disavowed him. You know, like everyone oh, yeah. fucking, yeah, man. It's, it's yeah. just, this is interesting. And you know what? I'm not saying it. I'm not saying it all spurgy or, or like you saw me in the fucking ring. I didn't go, fuck you, faggot piece. You know, I just, I just went, I, I, I just said it as serious as possible. I mean, it was still entertaining, you know, uh, cause he, he is what fucking Medicare just said, an internet tough guy, the definition of an internet tough guy. So failure, like, yeah, I mean, your loyalty comes cheap. Like, I, 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 I don't know what it's like behind the scenes, but I don't, I don't feel like Andy treated you unfairly. And if this is how Tonka treated you, and that's what he was paying you, why would you, yeah. like, why didn't you go to Andy's side on this? I begged you, failure. I begged you. Yes, you did. You did. I, I just was in a fucking funk where. You know, I was doing this show with this guy, and like I was telling you, like, yeah, I'm gonna probably go on my own real soon, blah blah blah. And it me, was always me and a... geek, me and geek, yeah. We're like, and remember that one day you were so upset about like just how he was treating you. Me, you, and geek talked for I think for a half an hour about your fridge habits, and we were laughing so hard that I was falling on the floor, oh, my, and I'm like, funny. I'm like, and I'm like, this is the show. This is the show. Yeah. And then like two, two days later, you're like, Geek's trying to steal my... I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about, Failure? Well, let's, let's just be honest. I'm, I was I was a fucking faggot. I was an idiot. I, I fucking had the fucking Stockholm Syndrome that everybody jokes about and that yeah, like people yeah. like fucking Vance still have. It, like I have... The 95 pounds I've lost isn't the only weight that I have list, lifted from me. The <laughs> fucking wheelchair and the fucking crippled engine are also fucking off my shoulders. Well, I, I can think of no better uh, revenge to a guy that um all right you want it hold on do you want a bombshell you want a bombshell drop it drop it tell him failure 
If you want to audit somebody, have the fucking IRS audit him since he fucking has his grandmother's fucking ancestor name in the fucking AdSense. Oh! Oh, fuck you! Oh, oh Tonka, Tonka, oh. Tonka. Oh my god! Bombs over Donga! <laughs> you wanna fight? Yo, you, you, somebody you. make that. <laughs> oh! Hey, someone has to do that. We got the other meme, but we got him. Like, seriously, like, just the music starts and then yeah. failure saying that. And then, but, oh, wow. Well, like, yeah, I, I known that for a while. And it's like, you know, a shitty friend that you know is fucking, you know, doing shady stuff and you don't say anything. Yeah, it, it, it's, it's fucking, fuck oh. him at this point. Oh, my. So, if it's, failure, stop telling him failure, stop telling yeah, him. Yeah, 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 2018, tell him failure, 2019, stop telling him failure. Uh, yo, that is, that is the most fucking, if his grandma is there, so, so, okay, how did, how does she, how does that help with taxes? She's older, I guess, and then gets less, because she's also, a senior. Also, he doesn't get bumped, bumped into a, a different uh, tax, tax uh, bracket. bracket. Also, oh, it might so be less, less uh, you know, let's think about this too. If he's getting any bennies from fucking the government, the last thing he needs is to make more money. So if he has a side, if he has a side business, attaching that with the, the, uh, the Kumite pretty much puts it on the new tax bracket, splitting it up with his grandma, and now makes his side business low enough that it doesn't hit that bracket. That is fucked up. That is that is IRS. Hey, fucking. Whoop. And then I, I I think yeah, you need to do a stream and just drop it all. And I and, and I, I would monetize the shit out of it because uh, he can't complain. He was supposed to be paying you. Uh, I say you get paid all the super berries he wanted and just dump fucking everything. Yeah. Well, you know, I'm on that crowd hit list, so something tells me, you know, <laughs> the problem Sandy is having right now, I might have myself. No, so, no, no. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Hang on. Someone mm -hmm. said that I already paid you back. I did not already pay you back. No, you're you're gonna pay me back. That's Zoom, 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 Zoom tweeted out uh, failure confirmed. Andy paid him back yesterday on Cog's show. I I said when my next paycheck, my yeah. my next YouTube pay, because I honestly I just did I did not get paid from Valor. Uh, mm -hmm. my flight, the stay, the food, and this the tri trip, and then the you know flying to nashville uh and then you know losing out on money uh someone just tweeted me like they said that you paid him back i'm going to pay you back when mm -hmm. the youtube check and i i i'm going to pay you back because um you manned up and i'm glad you're out of this spell and you do i i told people this i was telling people this the saddest part about this entire thing i don't care about fucking tonka and this and that it's it's i lost what i considered one of my best friends and mm -hmm. like, like you were there from, you know, when I was a man bun motherfucking Andy, you know? Yeah. And, uh, it, it, I, I did, you know, first theorize that like, you know, maybe Tonk cause the paranoia is so strong now with Tonka that I was like, is failure trying to still, Oh, you were paranoid as fucking. I was telling you, no, nah, I don't, I don't think he's trying to go after you, man. And fucking turns out, well, you saw what happened with, uh, the whole screenshot shit. Yeah. Okay. Uh, can I ask you a question that I won't I won't say the name on it, but why is he sending payments to you through an intermediary? Oh, because oh, you don't know about the Superberries card. He he would send the uh, vamp. He's trying to hide. Paper, he's trying to hide a paper trail, isn't he? Wait, That's why. Wait, he, wait. Well, I just got also that Tonka receives disability and food stamps as well. I don't know if that is a fact. Uh I'm that is kidding. from a friend of his. Yeah. So he right. puts it through his grandma so he can continue receiving disability, which is hilarious, first of all, and food stamps. Yeah. And this person knew that a year ago. I didn't know about that, but uh, if that's a fact, then oof. Oh boy. Well, hey, hey, Donkey, you got your wish. Failure finally told them. I hope you're happy, pal. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this is okay. So we have okay, we have a few things that we could look at. Okay, we have a fake name, uh, a fake, uh, you know, name change document, uh, a notary stamp. We have blood work with a different name on it. We have um, him pretty much sabotaging the fight, knowing that he was not going to fight with all these things. 
above. We have him putting his grandma's name on the AdSense. Him receiving disability. Holy shit, Andy. That's why he didn't fucking sign the proper name. Now I know why. Why? Why? If he had showed up in that ring under his YouTube name and he was identifiable oh. by his real name, they could have disability. connected him yep, to the disability oh. and shown that it was fraud. <laughs> Holy fucking shit. Oh my god, that's so true. That's maybe he is jacked. Maybe he is strong, but maybe he was like, "Wait, I'm gonna be fucking, fucking audited by the IRS." Was this was him? Was this him not being a pussy about fighting, but being a pussy about jail time? Which he then went ahead and did three more illegal things: fucking fake name, notary stamp, and fucking sabotage. This is fucked up. This is this is like literally you cannot write this shit. Like, like it's just everything come that that happened. This domino effect from the minute I promoted Kumite the first time, from the minute that Medicare jumped on it the first time and then it blew up. From it, you can't everything went. <laughs> me and JF splitting up. Him being part of that. Him fucking. Him saying don't talk to Zoom or anal vape. Then working with anal vape and then using that that quote unquote evidence to ruin my fucking life he tried to ruin my life using pedophile allegations because he knew that if he had to fight there was the possibility of him being arrested by fucking i mean for fraud for tax evasion and if we think about it now if we look back in hindsight now me accepting this fight and everything he tried to make it you know you'll make it fall apart is based on fear of what you just dropped failure that is fucked up wow holy mm. goddamn shit well that's that's it's a theory we don't know anything yeah, maybe, alleged, maybe, zoom, uh, uh, maybe zoom will drop some bombshells tonight and we'll find out more yo oh my <laughs> oh my oh my yo this is like yeah. how do you fucking trip over your own dick like this seriously and then it exposes that he was a cuck a couple of times and bought a beer for the guy. And now Slobby Robbie, the lawsuit with joint, like it's a fucking, and then not paying you. failure. You yeah. got raped in the money situation there. The amount of money mm -hmm. he, he never like uh, a, a few people asked me, I know it was Dick Masterson and all those guys were asking me, Hey, so did Tonka pay you when you were on, on Kumite, I never asked for a cent, and I promoted the Kumite after every Warski live. I never okay. asked for one so penny. Only people I know that got paid was uh, AP got paid twice, five hundred dollars from uh, Vamp, and five hundred dollars that I uh, paid him. That's, oh, that's and, all he... and he also paid uh, Ian Miles Chung when me and Ian, uh, Ian started working on Hype Break. Uh, Ian's mm -hmm. like, oh, he didn't, uh, like, I, I think he forgot. He was being very fair. Ian Miles Chung was being very fair with, with Tonka. I was saying, I think he forgot to pay me. So I went, so I went, I went, how much does he owe you? He said this much. I'm like, oh, just message him. And to be fair, Tonka paid him back. And then, uh, uh, fucking, uh, the, another lie was I wasn't paying, uh, Ian for hype break work, but the reason I was doing Warpath uh, uh, and I, I was using that money to pay Ian as well as Geek and then bought him the PS4 and now I'm working with SoCal and AG Luck and I'm working my ass off on the, on the video game and our new website that will be out soon. Oh, wait, wait, can I, can I ask a question, Failure? Can I say uh, who the person that sent you the payments was or no? Yeah, think, yeah, we already did. said it. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, right, um, and I explained it. Uh, basically, he would give her these prepaid. Oh, no, no, uh, that's what I'm saying. If if he really, okay, let's say the theory is actually true, and he's committing tax fraud to stay on benefits. Mm -hmm. Um, she's now on the chain too because she's an accessory. Oh. So, do you think Vamp is gonna roll on him when the fucking cops knock on her door? Fucking roll on him. <laughs> Brilliant. Possibly, possibly. I, I don't know. I think she's still fucking brainwashed, even though she spent two hours telling me how fucking of a terrible boy. Well, not boyfriend, their ex, but he just uses her whenever, you know, it's convenient for him. Oh, I hope you have some of that. Not, Play it on not, your not, screen. Not. Play it on your screen. <laughs> uh, by the way, not with his dick, probably, from what Cog said.
I don't know. You I never mean, had a heartfelt conversation about his erectile dysfunction with him? <laughs> no, I, I did not. He, he liked to slap. He, he he liked to claim that he was slapping his uh, dick against the mic a lot of times for some reason. I always found that odd. Yeah. And... <laughs> was the mic by his fucking pelvis? I was <laughs> on the wheelchair to do that. So th th there was the so there was okay so you saw him on camera when he I guess flexed for you and he was jacked yeah he he got up and uh, he he started doing these kicks and flying knee kicks but... <laughs> what hey, the he... shit are you two doing man what the fuck is well he wanted to he wanted to prove that he was in a uh, fucking shape or whatever and he came on cam one time and started doing these flying knee kicks and almost knocked himself out on the top of the fucking doorway. Cause, because he's yeah he, his trailer like like the door isn't high enough no we know uh but do you think he would be if he did fight me who do you think would have won um, they would be like I, a fair be, fight be, or... look before i saw you i didn't think you were actually getting into shape i, I thought you were still on the you know the coke ski diet <laughs> <laughs> and the uh the beef ravioli the fucking Chef yeah. Boyardee rabbit. And, and all the fucking Stellas. Every time I would, like, fucking take a peek at your stream, I would see you drinking a Stella, and it would be like, when the fuck is this motherfucker training? Holy <laughs> no, I I um, I was definitely training, and I, I did stop drinking. I, I, I did drink, I think, th three times throughout my training for a birthday, New Year's, and some other random event. And I did, I, I did sneak a few energy drinks from time to time, but it was mainly... Oh, I... Hey Andy, I'm sorry to interrupt. Right. I, I I got a dip. Um, it, it's been fun, boys. Uh, I look forward to more information coming out. Failure when you do do your uh, tell them failure stream and reveal everything. I'll put a link out for you because I want to see everything right. get dropped. Uh, uh, DM forward... me. I'll I'll send you some stuff if you're interested in taking. Okay. Speak. Yeah, and uh, don't forget, guys, check out Zoom stream. Apparently, there's some shit dropping on that. Andy, fantastic job. Thank you. Uh, way to make this guy look like a fucking retard. Uh, your channel obviously isn't dead. Uh, you've got 5,000 people watching you right now. Yeah. You've had streams where you've had between two to 4,000 watching you. So uh, I think you've returned to form. Good job. Everybody likes the Andy Redemption arc. Uh, Donga, you brought this all on yourself, you stupid fucking moron. I told you, sit on your ass and read the super chats and you'd be fine. Couldn't fucking listen to me. You had to do gay you, options. You even, gave us, you even gave us a second second chance by giving us a shout out during the mundane match shit. And he fucked that one up too. Yep, yeah, you know, hey, uh, Donga is a fucking moron, and uh, way to shoot yourself in the foot. By the way, Monday and Matt, take the fight. Take the fight. You'll get a fucking redemption arc easily if you fucking take a fight with Tonka off. And, well, and... Yeah, he'd win by default. Tonka would never show up. But I gotta go. Take it easy, guys. Peace. Yeah, peace, man.